Hey things! Haven't seen you guys in like a hundred years. I'm super excited to be here right now because we are going to start talking about animals. And I mean, you probably have figured out at this point, this is lecture number 24 in an entire semester. And you probably have figured out that pretty much give me a topic to talk about and I'm going to be excited to talk about it. And I'm probably going to say, oh my God, this is my favorite thing to talk about ever. But it's kind of true about animals and invertebrates. Like, wow, these things are so cool. So I know you've never seen this cladogram before, but let me just draw your attention, your focus to where we are in the big picture. In the last lecture, we looked at green plants and fungi. And today, we're going to start a two lecture series on animals. Now, I want to remind you that our coanoflagellates are the out group. They are the sister group to animals. We have characteristics we share with coanoflagellates. That's the signaling proteins. But all animals are multicellular and they all had a blastula during formation. So I need to show you, well, actually maybe what I should do is, um, I think I'm going to show you the blastula in the next section because that's what we all share in common. But we're going to slowly flesh out the animal cladogram. And we're going to look at, I mean, if you look at the side over here, you can see how many different kinds of critters we're going to look at. What, like six different groups of animals. Now, look, there's a whole section called worms. What you can know is that our treatment of critters is going to be unfortunately brief. I mean, we could go forever talking about all the different, I mean, that's an entire class. Take general zoology if you want to learn about all the different groups of organisms, different groups of animals. So we're doing a two lecture uh, surface attention to animals. And let's start out by looking at what makes something an animal. We already know that it's a blastula, but let's go look at one. <laughs> 